Blue Line Biogenic Compressed Natural Gas Facility was developed through the innovative actions of Blue Line Transfer and South San Francisco Scavenger Company, leaders in the waste collection and processing industry in the San Francisco Bay Area. The facility is essential in addressing numerous AB32 requirements as well as serving the communities that Blue Line and South San Francisco serve. The Blue Line facility features Zero Waste Energy's Smart Firm Dry Anaerobic Digestion System, specially designed to recover the organic waste stream's energy content in the form of biogas, which is a mixture of biomethane and carbon dioxide. The Dry Anaerobic Digestion System is capable of processing 11,200 tons of food and green waste annually. The facility captures the byproduct of the anaerobic digestion process in the form of biogas which is then cleaned and converted into compressed natural gas, CNG, to power their CNG-fueled collection trucks. In addition, some portion of the biogas is used in a specially designed boiler system that produces heat to run the operations. The final product for the solid material is a high-quality compost that will be processed off-site. Organic waste first enters the facility via the receiving area where it is inspected for contaminants. The organic waste is then tipped on the floor of the aeration bay for temporary storage prior to processing. Following material loading, air is supplied to the waste material through an in-floor aeration system. The additional oxygen supplied by the air system rapidly and evenly heats the material to process temperatures of 125 to 131 degrees Fahrenheit through an aerobic decomposition process. Exhaust air from the aerobic heating is treated in a biofilter to remove odor. The next step in the anaerobic digestion process is fermentation, which consists of spraying a liquid biological inoculate or percolate on the organic waste material. The percolate contains all of the microorganisms necessary to digest the material and produce high-quality biogas. This is stored in a below-ground tank. The fermentation period lasts about 20 days. The production of biogas can begin within six hours of percolation. Biogas from each digester is captured and piped to the below-ground percolate tank, where it is mixed to create a consistent methane content. Biogas is then piped to storage. Following the fermentation phase, the spraying of percolate is stopped and the termination phase begins. Biogas continues to be captured until the methane content reaches a predefined limit after which air is supplied through the in-floor aeration system to rapidly purge the digester of lean biogas and establish safe conditions for the removal of digestate. The Blue Line facility features two in-vessel composting or IBC tunnels to treat digestate that is removed from the Smart Firm system. The IBC tunnels are specially designed to rapidly drive odor causing ammonia from the digestate material through the precise control of airflow and temperature. The digestate will be treated in the IVC tunnels for up to five days before it is unloaded and hauled to a regional composting facility for final maturation and screening. Exhaust air from the IVC tunnels will be mixed with exhaust air from the aeration bay, smart firm digesters, and treated in an acid scrubber which will remove 95% of the ammonia contained in the air stream. Following pre-treatment in the scrubber, exhaust air will be polished in a biofilter to destroy remaining odor-causing compounds. The Blue Line facility is expected to produce up to 120,000 diesel equivalent gallons per year of CNG. This is enough to fuel approximately 10 to 12 of South San Francisco's Scavenger's CNG fueled vehicles. It's estimated that each collection vehicle will collect enough organic waste during just one route to fuel it for an entire day, creating a true closed-loop system that is one of the first projects of its kind in the United States.